Griffin, I'm the first referee in the Outback and I've come down here to the city to show you what it's all about. I'm going to show you something tonight you haven't seen before, you'll never see again and you're going to talk about it in years to come. I'm going to give you the uh, Outback National Anthem. Give him a rally. <laughs> your shirt coming down your back like a Venetian blind. Now ladies and gentlemen, I travel the length and breadth of Australia. This is the last boxing tent left not only in Australia, in the world. Yeah. We travel the length and breadth of Australia. We go right up to North Queensland. We go right up through the cane fields. We go up to Bamiga, over to Thursday Island, uh, challenging all comers and there's no one barred. And we come down through the coast and we get down to New South Wales. Have we got anyone here from New South Wales? Yes. Where are they? <laughs> well, they don't work in New South Wales. They go straight through now. The last time I worked there was about nearly 40 years ago. And then when we get to Victoria, have we got anyone here from Victoria? Yes. Welcome to Australia. I don't work there anymore either. <laughs> The last one I worked there was a place called Cassidy, as a matter of fact, after I'd done the Mount Gambier show. The reason why I don't work in New South Wales and the reason why I don't work in Victoria is because of the bureaucrats and the politicians. They want me to change my boxing tent up there to suit them, put a ring in and all that. Well, the ring is the people. That's what we got here. And it's been like that for over 100 years and I'm not changing it for anyone. So I told New South Wales and Victoria, if you want to see the real thing, you'll have to come up here and see it. And that's the reason why I don't do it anymore down there. I go straight through. I want to get to South Australia. I work right across the Great Australian Bight. Right over to West Australia. I work right up through the Kimberleys. We go up to Arnhem Land and the Northern Territory. And of course right down through the centre. Down to the most famous race meeting. Uh, apart from the Birdsville Company. Out back the famous Birdsville races. Challenging all comers, if you've never been to the Birdsville races, you better get out there because I tell you what, it's something to see. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Australia. Give me a rally. Australia. I'm just a figurehead and I'm going to keep it going whenever I can get up on that board up there. It belongs to everyone and I'm going to be around for a while here. Don't worry about that. Give me a rally. Now if you look up at them banners up there, all those fighters that uh, had a fight in me 10 except uh, the bloke that bit the bloke's ear off up there. Oh, that bloke up there, <laughs> none of those fighters have fought from me before. But these blokes have, that bloke Alan Moore and Paul Moore down the end there, they're my cousins, that's my family. They're the only two brothers in Australia that's ever won the same title, of all the way title of Australia. This bloke here is the famous cowboy. He's with me for quite some time. He can ride a horse, he can ride a bull, he can ride a camel, he rode anything he's got his hands on. He's got kids everywhere in Australia. The famous cowboy in my room. <laughs> If 
few more up there. Steve Axel, he's had a fight in a tent there. Hector Thompson, Mundine, the fair dinkum one, not the other bloke. All up there, there. Jeff White, Alan Aitken, all those blokes have had a fight in an old boxing tent up there. The last one left and it's on everyone's uh, bucket list to have a fight there. And I know there's a few big fighters here tonight. Well, we're going to sort the men out from the women here tonight. Now, if you win, you get a hundred dollars if you win for three minutes. If you uh, draw, you get nothing. But seeing that this is a big first session here, if you uh, lose, you'll get the experience. Give me a rally. Okay, now what I'll do here first, I'll bring my fighters out here. Usually we put them up on the stage, but we're going to bring them out here so you can have a look at them. Here you come, fellas, have a look at these blokes from all parts of Australia. And bring out the Sheila too, I'll be looking for a Sheila that wants to have a fight. I've got the beaver, she's got hairs on her legs and it's spear a rat. Bring her out here. 